Hello everybody, this is Tekka, and in this video I'm be going over the installation process, configuration, and some of the in-game commands for the Skills plugin for Bucket. Now, what this plugin is, A, this is a simple alternative to the popular MC MMO plugin for Bucket. It allows players to earn skills or XP by doing tasks assigned to the skill, such as if you want to increase your axe's combat skill, you would use your axe for killing. Pretty simple, there's a lot more to it. As you can see here, I have posted, I'm going to add the video and all that stuff. But getting right into it, we're going to want to open up our server folder and go into plugins. When you're in plugins, you can drag and drop the skills jar into your plugins folder and then run your server. And then it will create the configuration files and everything you need. So I'm going to stop the server real fast and then go into my plugins and then I will have the skills folder and in here I will have three files. I'll have the skills config, the high score data, and the players. Now players is where all your player information will go, high score is where the high score information will go, and the skills YML is your configuration. Now first of all we have the use SQL or well, SQLite so all this is just database things. If you know what these are, then go for it and use them. But if you don't know what they are, then just stick with the default settings for all of these. Then we have the money on level up. So how much money you'll be awarded for leveling up. So that's set to 20 by default. You can customize that as you'd like to. We have the item on level up. So you can have items rewarded to players when they level up. We have the lightning on level up. So a lightning strike will go off when you level up configurable. We have broadcasts on level up, so it just displays a message to the server when you level up. We have debug, which just leave at false for now. We have the use permissions for every skill. So that's simple enough as if you want the players to have a permission node for every single skill, you'd have to use this instead of just the regular skills permission. So you can have that if you would like to. Then we have the reset all skills on death, so if you wanted all everything to be reset when the player died, you could have that option. And then you could have lose levels on death, customize that. And then you have some messages, fall damage, uh, level up message, and lost levels. We have update true version, and then we have the skills. So I'm not going to get into all of these because they're pretty self-explanatory, but if I go into archery, I can enable that true or false. I can have the change the XP gain multiplier, so how much XP you gain at a time. And then we have blocks until one XP is added. Now an example is if I go to woodcutting, true XP multiplier. We have mine all blocks from first level, true. We could have the block level. 5 you get to 2, 17 and 0, and we have the XP when you mine 5 blocks you get 1 XP, mine 17 blocks you get 2 XP. So it's pretty simple, it goes with everything, you have the dirt, uh, the sand, for mining there's a lot more because there's a lot more blocks you can mine. And then we have the rewards, so you can give rewards for how many levels you get, fixed levels, you can give money rewards and item rewards. So that is the configuration. Now let's get on to some of the in-game commands. All right, so now we can go over some of the commands for this plugin. Starting off, we have the skills command, which will bring up your current skills and how much XP and your level for that skill. So if I go over here and I mine this diamond real fast. As you can see, I leveled up a couple times. I went from, because it's diamond, it obviously spams me more, it's worth more, but Brandon Hopkins leveled up in mining and now is level 1, you have been given 2 glowstone for leveling up. So since I don't have a, uh, econ economy installed, it's not going to give me money, but I leveled up 3 times so it gave me the appropriate amount of glowstone for my reward. And if I do the skills command again, as you can see I have Level 3, my XP is 80 for mining, and that bar shows how full your XP is. So that's pretty cool. Now there's the skills page, and like 2. We'll bring up other pages of skills, so as you can see, the only other page is the swords right now, and that is how much I have in swords. Then I could do skills, skills, and then the player name, so I'll just do my own name. And then I can see how much skills are for that player. 
Then we have the skills MySQL convert, so if you know what MySQL is and how to use it, you can convert your flat to a MySQL, so I could do flat to my MySQL, and then it will convert my files to MySQL. Then we have the skills check, so it checks if you level up, so if I do skills check mining, it will tell me how much XP I have until I level up for mining. Then I have the skills top, which gives me the top players for each skill. As you can see, the top player for mining is Brandon Hopkins with a level of 3. And then I can do skills reset, and that will reset all my skills. And then I can also reset players, so I can do skills reset, and then player names, so I can do player, player 1, and that will reset all of those skills, but they don't have skills files, so there's nothing to be reset. So that is this plugin. It's a very simple, easy to use plugin, easy to configure, and add some cool features to your server by giving people rewards for leveling up their skills. So I hope you enjoy the plugin. There will be a link to a post on techhut.us where you can uh, get to the bucket dev post and get some more information on the plugin. So I hope you have a good day, and goodbye.